Hello all, welcome to the official YouTube channel of English Department, MES Arts and Science College, Patambi. This is Nimisha. I am a student of third year BA Functional English. In this video, I would like to share with you a piece of information about All India Radio and this topic is taken from the electronic media paper of 6th semester BA Functional English. Come now let's move on to the session. All India Radio, officially known as Agashwani since 1956. Agashwani is a Sanskrit word which means heavenly announcement or voice from the sky. All India Radio is the national public radio broadcaster of India and a division of Prasar Bharati that established in 1930. It is a sister service of Prasar Bharati's DD and it is one of the longest radio networks in the world. The headquarters of All India Radio is at Agashwani Bhavan in Delhi. Bahujan Hitaya, Bahujan Sukhaya, which is the motto of All India Radio. That means for the happiness and welfare of all. All India Radio introduced a three-tier system which consists of a national channel, regional stations and local channels. All India Radio produces various programs in more than 20 languages and 179 dialects. In On 2nd October 1957, the Vivid Bharati service was launched to complete Radio Silent. Vivid Bharati is one of the best service of All India Radio. It is also known as the Commercial Broadcasting Service or CBS. History of All India Radio In 1930, Indian Broadcasting Company handed over to government and renamed as Indian State Broadcasting Service or ISBS. ISBS renamed as All India Radio in 1936. The external broadcast began on 1st October 1939 by the British government. All India Radio launched news on phone service on 25th February 1998 in New Delhi. This service was accessible through STD, ISD and local calls. At the time of independence, the All India Radio Network had only six locations located at Bombay, Delhi, Madras, Calcutta, Lucknow and Tiruchirappalli with 18 transmitters. Of these 18 transmitters, six were on medium wave and the rest on the short wave. The first FM channel was launched by All India Radio on an experimental basis in 1997 in Chennai. The Travancore State Broadcasting Station came into being on 12th March 1943, was later merged with All India Radio on 1st April 1950 and became All India Radio Tiruvannathapuram. All India Radio's Kochi Radio Station is the very first FM radio station in Kerala that was launched on 1st January 1989. Objectives of All India Radio all India Radio functions to preserve the country's unity and democratic values of this constitution. It prepares developmental and reference programs on various fields like agriculture, education, health, family welfare, science and technology. It encourages the consolidation and harmony of the nation and prepare programs for the rustic, illiterate and poor population, including the youth, social and cultural minorities, and the tribes and those of occupying the borders, backward or distant areas. So these are some important information related to All India Radio. I hope this video was helpful for you. Thank you all. Thanks for watching.